But do these need to be in here? They don't need to be in here. <laughs> I'm not saying that they have to be in them. <laughs> Why not? Okay. A little Christmas tree. Here, how about this? <laughs> hey everyone! <laughs> so today we're doing a very exciting video. In this video we are going to be doing another thrift flip. <laughs> Hi! We have had a freaking morning this morning. I lost all my debit cards, all my credit cards, all my ID, and my vlogging camera. Yeah. Today I thought it would be a fun idea to go, since I've lost all of my money, we're gonna go to the thrift store on mommy's dime. <laughs> Good. There we go, now the distraction is out. <laughs> so my idea today is to do another episode in my upscaling or recycling thrifted items. I did one of these before where I made like, it was like a moo moo and I made it into a pants and top, like two piece set. So today I'm gonna be doing something a little less ambitious. I'm either going to be distressing a jean jacket, like very distressed, or I saw this thing on Instagram and I went to go find it in my saved stuff and I could not find it so they must have deleted it but it's basically a denim jacket and then a mesh shirt and you cut little cutouts in the denim jacket and then sew on the mesh so it's kind of like this really funky denim jacket so we're gonna be heading in to the thrift store we're gonna try and find either a denim jacket and a mesh shirt or just a denim jacket we'll see leaning toward denim jacket and mesh shirt but we'll see so let's Get in there. It's really cold out, but let's get in. But this pillow is gonna complement the living room. It's very nice. Wait. That's so cute. I want like a kind of baggy one. I think we're gonna end up going in the guys section finally. I'm holding on to this. This is from Gas. I might want that. <laughs> this one's $5.99. I think I can spring it on mommy's wallet. So I think we're gonna end up distressing a jacket. I'm buying three. But uh, ooh, those shoes are so cute. <laughs> Too bad they're not my size. I think we're good. We're gonna get these three jackets. I'll show you guys them more when we're home. But these are steel. <laughs> Okay, so we just got back. I'm gonna quickly show you guys what we got and kind of the plan of action for this. You guys always say to make sure to wash everything after I get it from a thrift store just because you don't know who donated it or anything. And just so you guys know, I do put it in the wash. Maybe not wash, but I always put it in the dryer on a really high heat setting. So if there's anything, it would kill it. So, or we put it outside and it freezes. So that's always good. And then we have this shirt. And this is what I think I'm gonna try and patch the elbows with if I wanna distress the elbows. I haven't completely decided on everything yet. Also, reusable bag. I'm making my switch to reusable bags. <laughs> All right, and then I got this jacket, but I actually got this just for myself. Another one just for myself, not for the video. This is so cute, it's like a cropped jean jacket. I really am set for denim jackets now. I got like three. Now the actual jacket that I got for distressing is already a little bit distressed on the back. It's a nice soft material and this was $5.99 and this striped shirt that I got is $3.99. So we'll see if we can make a cute distressed jacket out of these two. But for now I'm gonna run down and put everything in the dryer. Heat it up real good. <laughs> We're good. Now we wait. All right. By the way, I got my shirt from Wish. I actually bought it not even for a video. I was like looking for stuff for a video and I ended up finding it. So, real stuff here. I have like an idea in my head that I don't know if I've ever seen before. So, oh, I like this little detailing right here with it flaring out like that. If we could get a back distress and then the bottom distress, I'd be pretty happy with that. All right, so here we have the $3.99, $5.99. So why six, four, 
ten dollars here <laughs> here's the jacket before and then here is the shirt before it's actually a really really comfortable shirt kind of don't want to cut it up but it's okay i'm gonna take this off and get started all right i just want to clear the air initially this video was going to be a tutorial on how to distress denim jackets and then i realized i don't know how to distress a denim jacket and while editing all this footage, I realized I never really taught anything. So this video is 100% just for entertainment purposes. If you can learn something from it, I'm very happy and I hope you can. But I just wasn't the best teacher in this, so yeah. So we've got some stuff here. We got a knife, a butter knife, exacto knife, sharpie, and a little thing. We've got my backsplash tiles to cut on. These are extras. Mm -hmm. Cardboard piece. We got the stuff. Okay, where your elbow is? Yeah, not too big. Okay. But not small. <laughs> there. Okay. So we got, that's kind of weird that my elbow's right on the, yeah. That is where it is. That's weird. <laughs> now my elbow's right here. <laughs> A decent sized elbow pad. Is this a bad idea? Oh wow, look at me. I'm ruining it. <laughs> okay. So once again, the sewing machine has completely failed me, but we are going to do an iron-on stitch, press down, very hard. Let's see what these look like. I don't know what year patched elbows was a thing, but I don't know. I think it looks super cute. But okay, I'm gonna throw this on. Love a good patched inner elbow. I'm gonna have to figure out how I had my elbows. <laughs> Perfect lines, perfect this, perfect that. Like it's all supposed to be kind of messy, which is definitely my type of crap. Here's what we took off the length. <laughs> You're gonna wanna try and pull on the blue. That's what's going to cause the fraying. So we're gonna put two towels underneath and just take full strands. We're just gonna distress for probably a good hour. All right, so after quite a long time of distressing, we've got the jacket pretty well distressed all around the bottom. The full back is distressed. <laughs> we distressed a lot around here, but okay, let's go ahead and try it on. Okay, so here is the first look at the distressed jean jacket. How does it look? I don't have a mirror in here, I gotta check. How I was thinking about styling it is having it like really loose and over the shoulder as like a shirt like this and then with like a skirt. So I think that when I get home, I will style a little outfit around it. But even just the way that a jean jacket is actually supposed to be worn, I really like it. I'm gonna style an outfit with the jean jacket and show you guys kind of like what I saw in my head. Uh, but I am really happy with how it turned out. Four to six days later. All right, you guys, so it is a few days later and I just finally got to styling this jean jacket the way I wanted to. Now, I personally would never feel confident enough to wear it like this, but I've seen a lot of like, Instagram models and stuff like this wear their jean jackets off their shoulders and I just think it looks so cool. So I styled this jacket like this. I'm gonna show you guys my bathroom is so messy right now so please try and ignore it. I'm really sorry. <sighs> I'm a mess. So what I decided to do is button down the two bottom buttons and then fold it over like that kind of as if it's like a shirt that goes off the shoulder and then I paired it with a corduroy skirt and then the sleeves are like kind of baggy you can see the pockets are down lower now I don't know I kind of think it looks does it look cool or am I wrong but okay that's basically all I wanted to show thank you guys so much for watching I really hope you enjoyed this little distressing a jean jacket video uh, I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!